Hi everyone, I have a project share for KS Craft. Um, I'll share with you the die and then I will share with you the project. So the first one is this 3D heart box. It's a really nice box. There's a lot of pieces. Um, a lot of it has layering pieces, which is really nice. And I really love this because it has drawers in it. And it's such a cute die set. So this is what I created here. And then you can see the hearts have drawers. Isn't that cute? And then you can see the shape of the heart. So you can see it's a pretty nice size box. Um, they've had also in the sample on um, AliExpress, you could see they created an album as well with this die. Um, but I was thinking you can also, if you just add a strap, you can create it into a purse as well. So lots of fun ideas with this die set, but I really love the drawers. Such a cute die set. So there's that one, and I'll put all the links to the dies down below. The next one is this really fun bag die, and it is this die set right here. So it comes with a scallop bag. You get a heart, two hearts, you can layer, and then um, this die that creates the hole here and makes a super cute bag. So I just added some Velcro on the top for the closure, and then I added some flutter buttons inside. Really cute die set. So there's that one. This one's a really nice one. This is huge. Makes a tag. You can create a banner with this die set. It also comes with these circles. So there's two different sizes, you can see. It's a really large one. And then it comes with these guys. And if you'll notice, it has these cute little butterflies. You can save those tiny butterflies and make it into confetti. And then this one has some really nice stitching on it. So I created a little hanging tag here. I added some twine on the top. And then I layered the smaller one on top of the larger one. And just embellished it. And you can see where I incorporated the circles. I put one here. I tucked it underneath the tag. And then the smaller circles right here. And you can make a fun hanging tag, or you can make a full banner, lots of ideas, or an album with this. Let's make a really pretty album. That's that die set. The next one, I love this one. This is a milk carton drawer die. I believe Nicole designed this one. And look how cute this is. So it looks like a milk carton, but it has drawers. So it perfectly fit my flares. So I have three different sizes in here. So it's a fun way to put some embellishments in here. Look cute. It was really easy to put together. And then I'll have to remove this. But I put some Velcro for the closure. And I fit my larger button in the center. So this is such a cute die set. I love this. And that's this die right here. I had to put the smaller pieces in a bag, but this is die set right here. And then it has all the layering pieces. Um, this one all the other dies it comes with. So there's a lot of dies in here. Um, create this project. But I love that, again, I love that it has all the layering pieces to add to this project here. Okay, so there's that die set. I have to put it in this bag so I don't lose my pieces. So that's that project. The next one is this really cute perfume bottle. It's a little shaker really pretty 
and that is this guy right here. So I used um, the two collections I used on these projects was Lucky Us and With Love. So this is the die. Makes a fun shaker. That's really pretty. So there's that one. And then the next one is this cake stand. This is really cute. So what I did to the cake and the macaroons, I added some foam to give it dimension. And then I just backed the cake stand with some poster board. So it's a little bit more sturdy. And that is this die right here. Get all these pieces right here. And then I added some of the glossy accent on top. Really cute die set. So there's that one. The next one is this cute little house. It's supposed to be like a gingerbread house, but I made it to a Valentine's Shaker house. And I love the cute little dies that it came with because you can use those as confetti. So I took the tiny little candy. Where is it? This cute little one right here. Gumdrop. So cute and tiny. And I put that in the shaker. And then I just added some seed beads. Isn't that cute? And you can see where I added the foam to make it into a shaker. And I thought that turned out really cute. It's a cute little embellishment that you can make. And then the last one are the conversation hearts. Love these. So you get four different sizes. You get the backing of the heart, which is just a solid heart. So you get this one right here. And then you get three that have a sentiment. I love you, hug me, and then sweet. There's this one. And so I just added some pop dot underneath the top layer. And you can make some fun conversation hearts. So that is my project share for KS Craft, and I'll put the link down below. Thanks for watching. Bye.